so hello everybody um I'm just gonna show you my cleaning technique of how I brush my teeth and floss and how I just keep up with my teeth um when you have braces it's you know you really have to maintain a clean mouth because because we have like you know um metal and you know this stuff can just easily get in between our teeth um that's kind of nasty if you you know go on without going with your day without brushing your teeth or you know brushing it in the morning or brushing it at night um don't get me wrong i'm not a perfect maintainable brusher like i brush my teeth in the morning of course and if i have time in the afternoon or after i'm done my lunch while i'm at work i try to brush my teeth but as how my job is you know it's hard to do so but i you know brush it at night if i'm not out or anything like that so but you just want to make sure at least twice a day y'all just brush your teeth at least twice a day um because you can find some you know food stuck up in there you didn't even know it was there just because it's not showing or it does not appear does not mean that um does not mean that it's in your teeth so i'm going to go ahead and get started i have um how i brush my teeth and what i use to maintain a, a good clean mouth uh, so the first thing i'm going to tell you all or show you all is my floss this is just a floss i got from the dollar general nothing too specific i don't know if you all can see it yeah, and um, so I'm just going to rip it. So it's about this long. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's about this long. And this is what I'm going to do. Sorry, my lips is dry, but I have my toothbrush and stuff here, and I don't want to, you know, get lipstick on my toothbrush. So um, I'm going to take the floss, and I'm going to kind of make it skinny or make it, like, straight like this. And I'm going to uh, take it and stick it in between my bracket so I can't really see okay just like that look that was easy I'm gonna pull it through and then floss now with the technique of flossing you just want to shake it all the way up till you get to your gums and I kind of like to move it around when I hit my gums because it can be food up there, so I'm going to take it and get like it. You see, I got food. And I'm just going to pull it through, okay? Now I'm going to pull it out. I'm going to do the same exact thing all the way over. So I'm going to make sure it's straight like this. And then... Stick it through, hold the string like this, shake it, go all the way up to my gum, roll it around, and pull it through. A hard place to get but you need to get those molds in between those molds these teeth are here these are here these two and these two like here you need to get those those be the main teeth that hold food i don't know why but in my mouth i know they do next i have a couple tools that will also help me get some food will also help me get some you know um garbage in between my teeth and um it's by the i want to say rexel the rexel i don't know but this is what it looks like um it's this tool here and it has this type of needle focus focus let's see i don't know if y'all can really see there we go like this and then this one has like a flatter piece on it so it's kind of flat and then this one is got a point this is my favorite one the one with the sharp edge 
So I do be careful with this because you can poke your gums, but this is really helpful as well. And I'm gonna show you all why. Okay, so let's just say, let me bring this down just a little bit. Okay, so let's just say, you know, let's get, basically if I have food in my mouth, so I will take it and I will just scrape it, scrape in between all of my pieces. And that thing here is too, it'll be food all of in here. So I take it, I just grab it around. Take it, grab it around, take it, grab it around. I kind of scrape as I, as I go to to get any plaque or anything like that. So take it. I did want to. and also the mouthwash. Um, they say that we are not supposed to use any whitening and this is all because the outer teeth, if you do like a whitening thing, the outer teeth is gonna be white. But once they remove your braces and remove that glue, it's gonna be kinda yellowish. So you wanna maintain a consistent color. You don't want to, um, if your teeth wasn't as white as when you got your braces, just know that same side these glue, the glue is, once they remove it, that's the color it may be. So you just wanna be really careful don't use anything strong. I'm not saying that not to use any whitening, but nothing too strong for your teeth um, to make it pure white or any bleach or anything like that. You don't want you don't want to go that route because I've seen people's teeth who had braces and you can tell the difference. You can also not even know that they have braces that they um, they had braces due to the fact it's two different colors in your mouth and that's not cute, you know, and it looks kind of gross as well. So you just want to make sure you do not do that at all. So um, toothpaste and mouthwash is the 3D Crest Whites. I absolutely love, I love this y'all. And they have different ones, but this one I have right here is a Glam Rivers White. I kind of use all of them, but um, I've been using this for the last couple of days. And of course, it's doing its job. I love it, I love it, I love it. So. I got the smaller one, I don't know if they have big ones, but this is just what it looks like. 3D Crest White. It removes up to 90% of surface stains in five days. Um, I think it's alcohol free, so that's also good as well. All right, so this is like an awesome toothpaste that is good um, for, you know, it's not too harsh. Uh, it's not that expensive and um, it's not like a bleach so I think this is really good you know cuz because I have braces I do want my teeth to be as white as it could possibly be but I don't want it to harm it too much as when I get my braces off I'll have all that color stuff going on okay so this is good y'all next is my mouthwash Bam! If anybody knows, this stuff is a, these two together is amazing. So they also have different types of uh, the 3D Crest White mouthwash, but I got the one that matches my toothpaste. So this is the Glamorous White. Yes, 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 yes. And this is alcohol free. So I kind of usually, you know, do this for about a minute or two. I can just, you know, brush my teeth and then use this 
and um, be doing my hair or something and um, it kind of burns just a tiny bit but um it's not that you know like the other ones I don't really like the other ones because they burn a lot but this one does not burn as much so I can deal with this and um I go through I don't know why I don't get the big ones but I go through this all the I go through these so fast so I got you know a good amount in here but um this is a really really good mouthwash that I use it's just the 3D Crest White Luxe glamorous white so i'm just like ocd about it if you're going to get the toothpaste you got to get the mouthwash that matches so double work double work okay two brushes i have two two brushes um well i have plenty because i have a couple in my purse i use two of them and i want to tell you why because you have metal you have braces in your mouth it kind of you know it's a uh, you can't get straight forward to your teeth because you have um, braces. So I kind of like to use a hard, hard bristles and then I use soft bristles for another reason. But um, I use the soft one because, um, so say if in the morning time I use the hard brush, my gums and everything kind of gets a little sore. Um, I don't try to harm my teeth or hurt my teeth or harm my gums and anything like that. But in order for me to get a good clean, I like to, like, I just, I have to, I don't know. I like to use, use a hard brush. Like, it just makes my teeth feel even much cleaner than what it already is. So, I just like, I like it. And it's kind of hard, like, hard gear. So, it, like, surpasses my braces and onto my teeth and my gums so that's why i kind of like the hard brush now for the soft um brush i like it because after i've done using this one and if i brush my teeth after lunch and dinner i can kind of just you know ease up on my teeth and get um use the soft one so it's kind of like you know not too um hard on my gums and my teeth after being manipulated by this bad boy here so i kind of use two but I'm going to show you all the proper way of brushing your teeth and how I was taught and also how I feel it's right to clean my teeth. This is my own preference. So I hope you all learn from this. But also, you know, if you like your own little method, then that's fine. So I'm so, going to go ahead and zoom in. Okay, so what I like to do is once I put, I want to use a saw brush for the moment though. So I will put my toothbrush, my toothpaste on my toothbrush. And what I do is first I will circle of motion. I do the top and bottom separately or sometimes together, but normally separately. So I will do circle of motions all around. Circular, 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 circular. All around, okay. Then I hit the bottom, do the same things directly on it, okay. So, because once you, when you do directly on it, you're right now you're doing on your braces, so you're cleaning all of this, all of this, okay. You clean it, plus a little under here, but mostly here first, okay. So, directly on your braces. You're gonna hit the top, so you're gonna put your toothbrush here, down, and then you're going to rush, 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 rush. Turn it over, rush. Get all the way back there. Rush, 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 rush. And this is because the clean not even your teeth it cleans the top of your braces here gets under your braces all of this under 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 same exact thing same uh, 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 uh. switch your hand uh. it's like that now kind of the soft one will help um so, I will just go directly towards my gums, here. All on the gums, all on the gums. Just like that. Down, all on my gums, all on my gums. 
And y'all, to be honest, my gun used to be so dark. Like, you see how this is? It used to be dark all up here. But, you know, I'm learning how to brush. When you brush your gums, it makes them pink. You know, so just brush it, brush it, brush it. Of course, you do your tongue and all that other stuff. And then I'll get a hug. So then I just, you know, do it all over again until I feel as though my teeth is clean. So. You know, y'all keep y'all keep clean. That's the most important part. You know, um, it really helps. It really do help. Okay. So, um, and it also the more you brush your teeth, you don't want to excessively brush your teeth. But the more you brush your teeth, it's easy for your teeth to shift. I didn't know that, but I learned that. So once you like, when you especially cleaning your gums and things like that, it loosens up your gums. Therefore, your teeth, whichever way, you know, the braces are taking you, your teeth is able to shift over or shift and things like that. So, um, that's pretty much it, you all. I have my flow. This is my step one. My Rexo tool, step two. My, my toothpaste and my toothbrushes, soft and hard bristles and my mouthwash is the last step okay so that is pretty much it i hope you all really enjoyed this video i hope it was very informative and i will catch you all later my next appointment is not until what was it may yeah and then the next time i will be getting let me zoom in for you all. Next time I will be getting set the power train all at the bottom here. I will be getting it all at the top here. So therefore, everything can just start shipping, shipping back. And that's what I want. So everything is like evenly. See this gap here? Yeah. So everything is lined up perfectly. And then this side, this tooth here is like stubborn. Like, I y'all hate my guy. I hate this guy here, but it's you know moving slowly but surely so this will be here by me hopefully and yeah so 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 but i really appreciate each and every one of y'all i hope this video was very very informative and um let me know if you have any questions or concerns i will definitely get back with you all i'm kind of consistent with that um, responding and things like that. So, you have any questions, just let me know. I will kind of, um, I will just link my tools or place my tools down below about whatever I use, especially my mouthwash and my toothpaste. So, um, yeah. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And please, if you have not subscribed already, hit that subscription button. You all, please watch my vlogs. I mean, like, don't you want to know what I be doing during the weekends and stuff? So, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, so I'm trying to grow this channel and I need you all's help. So, hit that subscription button, comment down below any comments or concerns. Also, follow my Instagram, follow my Snappy Chat, and uh, thank you all so much. I'll talk to you later.